So we're going to begin by pushing back that cuticle. Is the lighting good to you guys? Let me know in the comments below. And we are, we decided to extend our 50% off sale. So we have a blowout sale for a lot of items on the website that we put at a blowout price, which I think is incredible. 50% off. That is a ganga, isn't it? So let's push back that cuticle. Are you guys ready for the weekend? What are you guys' plans this weekend? Let me know in the comments below. I actually went to bed really late last night because um, Mortal Kombat came out, the movie. Oh. And I was like so excited because I used to play the video game all the time as a kid. And I was like, well, that movie's finally out, the reboot. And it was a disappointment to say the least. It was like they're trying to act really serious, but it comes off like super cheesy. So it was, it was, it, no, I was disappointed a little bit. I'm glad Nicole wasn't in the first one. Did you watch um, Godzilla? Versus King, King Kong? Kong? No, that looks terrible too. <laughs> it doesn't look computerized? Really? It doesn't look like you're watching a video game? Really? No, it doesn't. So we're going to start out by using the diamond mani bit to push back that cuticle and get, start getting rid of all that crust and blist. Take it on the sides and on the skin. Let me know if you guys have seen Mortal Kombat yet. It was, but it was like more serious. Like I think the acting was better. This one, it was just like they were trying to be so serious because the video game has a very serious tone to it, but the movie just didn't translate well. That movie was shot in September of 2019, and it just came out now. Really. Isn't that crazy how long it takes for a movie to be made? So very gently go in and clean, clean, clean with the diamond mani. I like to take it up on the sides and around the cuticle so that way we can begin the snatching. What kind of movies do you like, Sherry? Um, I like all kinds. Do you like Not scary movies? movies? Yeah. Love scary movies. Scary ones, and I like the ones you have to like um, think about. Yes, yes, suspense and like thrillers. Yes. Do you like political movies? Mm, yeah. I can watch them. Or comedies. Mm -hmm. yeah. Raunchy comedies. Uh, I don't know about those. My <gasps> husband does. Really? Yes. Yeah. Move the dog. Oh, that's Street Fighter, not Mortal Kombat. Oh, it would have been good if he was still around. That was more uh, Street Fighter, not Mortal Kombat. Raul Gulia wasn't that. We're going to use the diamond prep now to begin the removal of the dry skin and clean out that cuticle. So I like to hold my hand like this, with my two fingers like this, so that way that bit can really go in and begin to get rid of that dry non-living tissue, see? Like, it could be the because we're so close to the camera now. But if, if it is, I can try to moving the tripod over a little bit more. They were oh. fighting each other, said. Who was? Antonia says, so I don't know. She's blurry, too high to the camera. I'm sorry. So let me try moving the tripod over this way. Hold on one second, you guys. It's gonna look crazy for a second. Please avoid that earthquake. I think that might be better. Possibly. Okay. Is that better? Oh, the feedback? Yeah. Oops. Where goes that? The rat trap. <laughs> it looks like a giant rat trap, doesn't it? Okay. 
think that's okay. Hi. Awesome. Did you love it? I'm loving all this stuff. Are you obsessed? You know, you know, Couture.com makes the best nail products in the world. So thank you so much, you guys. And you know, if we reach 100 views, we're gonna do a live giveaway at the end of the video. So make sure you like and share this video. Post it in that favorite nail group. Tag your mom. Tag your dad. Tag your aunt. Tag your cousin, so that way they can watch the snatching of the phalanges. Is it better now though? Yes, come on down. Four hour flight. Look at that you guys, how that bit just really removes all that drying on the mink tissue. And make sure you do this step dry, because if you do this wet, it won't work. So you want to make sure that the hand is completely dry. If, for example, if she has climbing hands or something, No, they can still see. Beautiful. Still the same. We can see your... My sleeve. <laughs> she said it. Smoothy arm. My hairy arm. I think it's so funny when videos go, Why is his arm so hairy? Because I'm, I'm, I'm a man. We're, we're hairy. Not all of us, but a lot of us are very hairy. And I'm too lazy to get it removed. And laser hair removal hurts. So that is not an option for right now. <laughs> but remember you guys, the snatching of the cuticles is the most important part. I think a clean cuticle makes the nail look a lot better. And another benefit is it also lasts a lot longer too. Beautiful, look at that. I know, you go at over 20, how many days? Easy over three weeks. At least 21 days, huh? Clean out her free edge a little bit. And even though like Sherry like literally rips her nails off and she's not supposed to but she still does, her <laughs> nails are in pretty decent shape actually. I got any soapy nails off. Sherry's like, no, I just want them <laughs> off so I can get fresh. So now we're gonna go in with a little coat of nail prep and then one coat of primer. Remember you guys, one of each. One of Do you have any plans for the weekend, Sherry? Nope. No? No. My kids went to California, my grandbabies. Really? For a um, holiday or just for a... Uh... For mom and dad's anniversary. Oh. My oldest. My like, other ones are... Like San Diego or where? Yeah, it's not that hard to Right. So we're going to use a long sculpted coffee today. Let's see what size it is. I should know already. But at my age, you know, my memory isn't what it used to be. I can't believe Mother's Day is also like right around the corner too. It is way too soon for it to be Mother's Day. Do you guys go all out for Mother's Day? Um, no. No? Uh, hello from Delaware. Hi from Delaware. Thanks for joining us today. You guys, if we have 100 views at the end of the video, we're going to get do a giveaway. So like and share. Tag your friends. So that way everybody can watch the snatching. Hello. We usually like a breakfast or lunch. Do you uh, like go out or have it at your house? Um, we used to go out. Um, we'll probably just do it at home. 
Mm. Can you imagine how busy the restaurants are going to be? Yeah, that's usually a So because Sherry's nails are a little bit on the flat side, I'm going to do a little bit of clear press-on gel on the free edge. And this will help build up her apex a little bit, so that way I don't have to use so much gel on the inside of the one, two, three, go. So that way it sticks really nicely. And this is true for like, especially like the 5XL and all those really like fantasy shapes. Let's bake that 30 seconds. Vietnam. Oh, the crunk. There we go. Yes. No, no, a little bit longer. <laughs> so we'll apply them today with DIY gel, just to mix it up a little bit. The girls have been loving DIY gel, you guys. We're so close. We're halfway there, you guys, with the giveaway. Come on, come on, come on. Hi Sue, who is going to be the winner, winner, chicken dinner for today's live video, you guys? If we reach, how many views, Sherry? A hundred views, we're going to do a giveaway at the end of the video, you guys. So I know we can do it. So we're going to take clear press on gel. Sorry, not clear press on gel, DIY gel. Squeeze a little bit out. Use that bottleneck. Okay, you can take it out now. Leave a little bit of space at that cuticle area. And then freeze. Technically, if you apply enough DIY gel, you don't really have to freeze it because it kind of stays in place really well. But bad habits are hard to die. Stunning, 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 stunning. And in seconds, literally. So remember, DIY gel is a little bit on the thicker side, so you do need to go to use some elbow grease. So squeeze her out, make sure you apply enough. Debbie says thank you. Thank you for what? Thank you for the... Thank you for the music? For the face gel tip. DIY gel? Yeah. You're welcome. No Fabulous. I'm so glad it helped. And you get a really beautiful, flexible wear as well, too. Another one is good. Good to know I have large, flat nail beds. And we'll try putting some press on gel on tips. Yeah, build out your, your natural free edge using the gel prior, and it'll make a huge difference. It is the, the revolution, you guys. No smells. You can do literally the nails in half the time. Good night, Max. Trinidad in the house. Trinidad in the house. What's up, Mama? And then freeze her for a few seconds. Hi from the Netherlands. Hi from the Netherlands. Yes, I was telling Sherry that I'm going to be a guest speaker at an eyelash conference at the Scottsdale Lash and Brow Conference the 14th and 15th of May. And I'm excited but a little nervous because I'm like, what am I going to talk about at a lash conference? Look at that shape, you guys. It is stunning. But it's also exciting at the same time. Nobody gets like food. It's kind of boring there. Oh, I don't think so. They're going to be like, we want our lash. Have you gone to Scottsdale? I haven't gone in forever. Yeah. They have a big racetrack out there, don't they? Has your horse raced recently? They have. And how did they have to have they doing? They had one win. A couple. So so races. 
Cookies will make it. Make sure it's fine now. DIY on the inside. Who wants to cook you're going to have to pack them out. Probably not. What am I going to talk about lashes? Can you imagine? I'm going to be like, I am the wrong person for this. No, they want me to talk about marketing. But it'll be fun. And it, I'm mostly going to support the organizer who is a friend of mine. That's the main reason I said yes. Yeah, Miss Marisol Corn Cornwell. Like long eyelashes? Or anybody just my eyes. I'm one of those like things. We're gonna bake it now for one minute inside the dazzling dark room. Yeah, I was like, what am I gonna talk about? Like what am I gonna do all day? Because they have like different classrooms and things like that about eyelashes, and I'm like, well I don't do eyelashes, so what am I gonna do all day? And it's not they think? Yeah. And I have to go early well not early on Friday, but I have to go there Friday night because it's there a party for the uh, the people that are involved and then the next day is like a party for everybody. It's a lot of party. Australia in the house. Really? Yeah. Is that hard like for her? No, it's that. On that fast, one of the fastest full steps in history. So now I'm going to use the 100 grit file from the fantastic file. I'm just going to shape it up a little bit. Those sides are nice and straight. Because nobody wants a fat nail. I'm gonna make a skinny mini. And then nice and square, so that way it lasts. So the girls love a square nail. Me too, I like the super boxy square look. I think it's so trendy. It's very 2021. Yeah. Very, very square. Everybody's really quiet today, I'm surprised, huh? Yeah. Are you guys already pre-drinking? Are the girls ready to party, is that why? Thank you. It's actually a shirt, not a blouse. We're wearing some vintage Ralph Lauren today. But it is hot though, I think of all these lights I'm under. I've tasted alcohol, I'm like, this tastes terrible. Why do people like it? Right? It tastes like medicine. It's good food. And Tony says she's adding things to her cart. That's she's like shopping. Uh, do you like drinking sherry? Um, yeah, I can drink. Socially? Mm -hmm. What do you like? Oh, you know what? I tasted it's a tamarindo mm -hmm. vodka. And it's really good. So it's a tamarind vodka? Ice. So tamarind and mango? Well, it's just tamarindo. That's the brand or that's the flavor? No, that's the flavor. Oh. It's, um, I don't know what the brand is. But, and I put it in the lemon juice and it's so good. And it tastes like the tamarindo candy. Really? Wow. So that's your new go-to drink? It's scary because it doesn't taste like an alcohol. 
And then when it, when it hits you, it's like when you're like, whoa. Mm-hmm. Have you ever been to Contiki's here? No. What's the famous drink at Contiki's? A scorpion. So we're going to use the golden wombat today to blend in that beautiful. I heard people have died with a scorpion. That's what they only really? have too. Yeah, you've never heard that? Uh-uh. I wonder if it's like an old wives tale or something. Uh-huh. I'm going to go in and blend that beautiful area. Wow. She's ready for the weekend. I heard there's another one, a Topo Chico alcohol drink, like a pre-mixed one, like a, I guess like a flavored seltzer water. Oh, you know what I tried for the weekend? Really? Yeah. Not good? Uh, I didn't. What about like a, a michelada? I can do that. Uh, Bloody Mary? Yes, with the cucumber vodka. With the cucumber vodka. And that tastes no Really? Wow. Yeah. So it sneaks up on you. Yeah. And then back in with the diamond mani to really airbrush the cuticle. Mm-hmm. There's a drink from Mexico. I think that it has a toe of a dead man in it. Tequila. It's a tequila. <laughs> I've never heard of that one, but I, I have heard. heard of that one either. I've heard of the worm one. I've seen the worm one, but I've never heard of the toe. And the worm one is the worm from the from the plant that the tequila comes from, right? Yes. Yes. Uh-huh. But I've never seen the dead man toe. Is that a real toe? I don't know. Well, it probably doesn't have any bacteria because it probably has so much alcohol in it. Right? Um, there's another one. It's um, the membrillo. So it's sweet? It's a membrillo from Mexico. You can't buy it here, but it's so good. Really? It has a dead man's toe inside of it too? No, that does not have a dead man's toe. <laughs> I remember I used to like to watch Sex in the City and they would always drink, um, what are they called? Cosmos. A cosmopolitan. And I was like, oh my god, it looks so glamorous. And I remember tasting it and it tasted like hairspray. I'm like, this is terrible. <laughs> and Tony was supposed to just Google the dead man. Tequila. <laughs> Kathy wants to know what the difference between sculpture and other things. So the sculpture, uh, sculpture series have a higher apex and more of a, a C curve, and they're a little bit more skinny than the natural ones. So the regular nails are more for like flatter nail beds or just like. If you want a softer look, and the sculpted ones definitely look a lot more, not necessarily um, like acrylic nails or things like that, but they do have a more dramatic uh, shape, see? So this one's sculpted, and you can see from the side, it has more of an arch to it. My son's watching it. He's supposed to be at the beach. And maybe he is watching you. <laughs> He's like, my mom's on TV. So I'm going back in with that diamond prepper to really blend out that cuticle ever so gently so that way I make sure everything is really blended for Phil. And I'm using it at a really slow speed, okay? Okay, Antonio, Antonio says it is called the sour toe and it's actually a canadian oh okay i'm gonna take the sour toe i'm gonna take spanish what does it taste like it just doesn't sound like you no. <laughs> taste it. Why, why 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 the toe is there a purpose to the toe is there a rhyme or reason So right now I'm going in with the 155, oops, sorry. sorry. Just to really blend out that shape, make her really nice and even. (laughs) 
Remember, if you want really straight sidewalls, you guys, when you're filing, what I recommend is you file the nail, what we call an eagle eye view, so you look straight down the nail like this, and make sure those sides are really nice and straight, and you have an even taper, so that way the nail is really aerodynamic. So when you're filing, you only want to see that center line. If you see any gray on both sides, that means the nail's not going to be consistent. Okay, so Mariana, this popped in. These are long sculpture coffins? Correct. Let's make sure they're nice and even from this angle. Hey, from Georgia. Hi, from Georgia. But where, where are they getting the toes from? They're I know. <laughs> That's scary. Are they donated? <laughs> like when you know they have organ donor on your card? Did you ever hear the old school rumor that if you have organ donor on your card, they don't want to save you? No. They want to let you die so that way they can use your organs for I, science. I've never heard that one. Really? Uh -huh. Yeah, it was like an old wives' tale. Like if you're, say you're an organ donor, they're not gonna like try to save you. I'm gonna take my purple buffer and move this shine off the one, two, three, go. Antonio's husband is watching Mortal um, Kombat. Oh, right now? How does he like it? Wendy says they're waiting for their kids to go to bed so they can watch it. <laughs> it's not. I didn't. I didn't think it was that bad or that gory. No. No. For stuff that you see nowadays on TV, it was pretty tame. Okay, the toes are all donated. I'm gonna put that in my will. I wanna donate my toes <laughs> to the tequila company in Canada. Jackie Rusty says, hi Matt, happy Hi. Friday. Antonio doesn't want to bother him, he really gets into it. He gets lost in the zone. <laughs> so I'm going to do a little bit of primer at the cuticle area just to blend it in really nicely. And now we begin the snatching. Oh, see. So we're gonna use a flash gel on three fingers and two fingers will have stickers. So these two will be our accent fingers. And then the other three will have the, the flash gel that the girls love. But let me turn on the hard light for, for the girls because they love the flash gel with the hard light. Love it. The only thing I don't know what essentials I need. Get you a one, two, three go kit. It has everything you need to get started in the dark arts. And so that way you won't make the nail like super thick or anything like that. Just apply the gel in thin coats. Does it look sparkly when we put it on? It does. Uh, I don't know. I only work with my products, oh. so I wouldn't be able to answer that for you. But mine, we only work, we only test and work things together in our system because everything is designed to have synergy. So if you're going to be mixing things, and I don't know. Do not mix this product. You got to stay with one brand. Beautiful. Make sure there's no excess on the side. Okay, let's bake that 30 seconds. Did you eat all your candy, Lena? Really? Hmm? 
Mm-hmm. No. Not yet. <laughs> oh, little by little. One of the mail carriers says, wife makes candy. And if I wasn't on a diet, I'd probably finish the whole jar by myself. <laughs> Uh huh. This is 147, the original. Thank you, I appreciate that. Get on my nails. I'm sure that application is nice and smooth. Max, what are you over there eating? It's uh, they put this Mexican candy in a mason jar and it is, it's the devil. It's so addicting. Because I like spicy candy. I think for people that are not used to it, they're like, what? I am. I love <laughs> spicy candy. Spicy and sour candy are the best. Who's texting me at this hour of the day? So rude. Beautiful. Okay, let's go ahead and bake that. bills out too. I was like, should we do dollar bills on here? She's ready for the strip club. She's like, no, it's Rebecca. Do you want to know how long it lasts? It lasts? Three weeks. They last me at least three weeks. Something. Three weeks to a month. Easy. Yep. So, I got my tweezers, my silicone tool. And where did Gloria put my scissors? I don't know off the top of my head, I'm sorry. So I'm going to use the silver hologram ones. But I think the pictures are just as pretty well. glitter too to fill in the gaps too to make the nails more more 3D. Oh, make sure the stickers never touch the edge, okay you guys? If you apply your, your sticker or your design too close to the edge, it's easier for it to peel. Press 
down firmly so that way she don't go anywhere. Aren't they dope? The black really makes it pop, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. also going to use press on gel and that's going to give it more volume and more definition to the design let's put in a little moon at the top Design on camera, kind of, or are we too far away? Hello from El Paso. Hi from El Paso. Thanks for joining us today. So after you apply the design, really press down firmly to make sure it doesn't go anywhere. Cute. Going to be pretty at the ring. Isn't she? And you guys, these nails last Sherry's lifestyle, so you know they're strong. Yeah. But you have to apply them properly. You have to re really pay attention to all the tips and tricks and secrets that we give you guys. This piece ought to look better without the moon. Without the what? The moon. Really? Oh. I like Oh well. But she loves them. Tomatoes, tomatoes. That's the great thing is that we can really customize it to everybody. You know what I mean? You can do it for however you like. They last, because they last how I take them off. Yeah, and also like applying press on gel on top. I just love how it looks. It really like creates the volume and depth in the design. center looks so cool too. You always do a wonderful job. Oh, thank you. I try. No, I always get compliments. Really? Mm -hmm. That's the best way to build up a clientele. People always ask me, they're like, how, what's the best way to get clients or to get people in the door? And it really is um, word of mouth. Mm -hmm. Word of mouth is the best form of advertising. Because, I mean, social media is great, but, like, for example, let's say you live in here in, in Tucson, right? If somebody in, like, Oklahoma likes your picture, that's great, but I don't doubt she's going to go from Oklahoma to Tucson to get her nails done. And word of mouth is just still a true and tired um, uh, method of getting clients. Mm -hmm. the oh. Five XL stiletto. I absolutely love them. Oh my god, aren't they dope? It's so hard to choose the right. Snatch the phalange with, but they're all so beautiful. One more black one. Let's do a little a black moon. Disneyland. So now we're going to take the press on gel and we're going to give the nail volume and this is going to help encapsulate the sticker 
and it's also going to act as our base to apply the frozen glitter on top. So a nice, even, thin coat of clear press on gel over the entire phalange. Very, very thin. And really work it into the sticker, okay? <laughs> what? Here we go again. <laughs> Never ending story. I just love her. She so funny. She's on top of it. She is. So I need my brush. Where do I put my brush? See the magic light? I'm going to get frozen glitter. For the brown, and then we can go in and apply the glitter around the phalange. The girls can see the design. Mm, adorbs. The Packers laugh. You can hear it all the way over here. <laughs> that is funny. They're having way too much fun being on their ship. Yep. <laughs> Why do they get the job done, right? It seems like it. <laughs> Jeez, I want to be a Packer at Exclusive Nails. That's where the party's at. <laughs> Pleasure. Don't forget, you gotta buy enocouture.com though. Gotta keep her going. The number one brand in the universe, hands down. Yep. And proudly made here. Support American companies and American manufacturing. Have you seen all the uh, commotion about they want to make Washington, D.C. a state? Yeah. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. <laughs> And then you do that to Puerto Rico then too and Guam and all the other ones. Beautiful. Look at that you guys. 
Adorbs. So let's bake this now for one minute. <laughs> Isn't it Adorbs? Mm -hmm. Man, I really need to get YouTube Premium. The ads, I swear, like one day I'm just gonna like shoot myself in the foot from all the ads on YouTube. That's crazy. I know. They should pay me. Yeah. At least now on Instagram I'm getting monetized. Yeah. Yeah. I get like one penny per like every hundred views or something. Really? It's crazy, yeah. I'm not sure how it works, but like one video has like three dollars and I was like, yay! In a year, I'll be able to buy a Starbucks. <laughs> Can you take it out now, my dear? So now we're going to do shiny. Nice thin coat. Or when you have stickers, you want, always want to do two coats. Okay. The hideout. <laughs> oh my god, that place is always packed every time we go by in the afternoon. Uh -huh. That is the place. I wonder if the food is good there. You know what? I don't know. I heard the menudo is really good. Yeah? I haven't been in a while. In that area since probably I had to pick up my dad or my uncle. Really? Like before I even got married. The good old days. <laughs> Were they real traviesos with your dad and your uncle? Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Good time. They sure enjoy their life. They did. No regrets, right? Let's bake that. 30 seconds because the ones with stickers, I'm going to do two coats so we can really encapsulate it. They would have told me what they did back then. Nowadays, they would not have survived. They would have been arrested. <laughs> but it was also like it was safer to go out back in the day, too. Especially here in Tucson, like every, like, well, not now, because everything is shut down, but like before, they would have like a party and there was a shooting. Right, right. They would have a quinceanera, there was a shooting. They, I'm sure there was fights. What it is now. So, one more coat of shiny on top of the glitter ones. I'm going to do a coat of shiny on the inside to make that now very glass slipper cinderella like. See it really just makes it super transparent. Focus camera. There we go. Beauts. Okay, now we're gonna bake it for one minute. One minute inside the dancing garden Do you have any plans for this weekend, Lena? Really? What's going on? You gonna go party a little bit? I haven't had the pleasure yet. <laughs> She's gonna live it up this weekend. Sounds like it. Yeah. <laughs> I hear a lot of blowing and screaming coming from the movie. <laughs> from Mortal Kombat? <laughs> I fell asleep watching it. I have to uh, finish watching it today. That's my Friday night. Is it a long one? Oh, it's only an hour and a half. 
the uh, the Superman or what is it? Avengers? What's the new one that came out? Justice League. Oh. That one's like four hours long. That's way too long Crazy. for me. Yeah. yeah, no thank you. So I'm just gonna make sure that the sides are nice and skinny mini. Because the last thing we want is a fat nail. We want her to have her spanks on. So just go back in with like a 150 or 180 and just really gently refine the sides, okay? Anything coarser than that will take off too much product. We just want to like really gently refine. Beautiful. See, now that shape is back to where she was at the beginning. And now a little bit of cotton candy cuticle oil to hydrate. I'm like, why, Gloria? They're empty. Throw them away. <laughs> so, oops, sorry. I'm going to turn this off so that way we can get that hard light realness. There we go. Look at that shine. Can you guys see that diamond sparkle? It's so cool looking, huh? It is. Beautiful. And that shape of the nail is really pretty, too. Look at that. Well, my love, that's going to wrap it up for today's demo. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to check out enocouture.com for the best nail products in the universe. And, of course, the hottest full coverage gel system in the world, the 1, 2, 3, go. I love you guys. Stay safe. Stay out of trouble. And I'll see you guys in the next live video. Bye, everybody.